Hello guys, old Scott Tucky Hillbilly, how you guys doing? This is another line in my uh, series I forgot to make uh, with the holidays coming up and got sidetracked of uh, single shot shotguns or rifles. And this one in question is a single shot 12 gauge. And this one was a gift to me by a fellow Kentuckian. So it's a special one. This is a Bacal. I know it's made in Russia. Yeah. Let me turn around here so you can see the name of it. I know y'all seen it before. Bacal. 12 gauge. And uh, it's a it's what I'll call a little thumper. He cut the barrel down to 18 inches. And uh, I put this little lens saver back on the back. And believe it or not, I like to shoot slugs through this thing. A little thumper. It'll knock your butt off, buddy. But I love it. But, uh... You can't beat a single shot shotgun on anything. Breaks down like this, which is sweet. Got a little brass bead up front. Uh, I did put a little bit of a uh, sandpaper crap on it here just to help me hold on to it because this polymer stock was kind of slick. So it just helps me hold on to it when I get some pretty heavy loaded uh, 12 gauge. And I mostly shoot double lot buck or slugs through this, so it's a ball. But what a part of a, the versatility of a 12 gauge single shot is, and I've showed these before, but this is going to fit into this series, is these adapters by Short Lane. And these are rifled adapters. And this is the 9mm adapter. It's got all rings on. This is a rifled adapter. It's not a smooth bore. It's a rifle. So if you're going to get some, get the rifled ones. Don't get the smooth bore. You're just wasting your money. This is a rifle. 9mm adapter. Fits right in the chamber of the 12 gauge. Oops. Sorry, guys. I hit my tripod there, so I knocked this for a loop. Let me straighten this up here. See if I can't get the camera straight. Sorry, guys. All right. I'm working around it. So you know this is live. This is like Memorex. But it slides right in your chamber here. Just like that. And uh, you put your 9mm shell in it. Close it up. Good to go. Now it won't eject your shells. So you just pull it out. But there's a 9mm adapter. Which is sweet. I mean, yep. Yeah, which is sweet. And I'll put it back up in this little case here. You just keep a little lube on them. A little bit of lube on your O-rings so it uh, keeps them pliable. And this is a little short 22 long rifle adapter. And it's rifled also. So there's a 22 long rifle adapter. And just goes in there just like that. Close it up. Good to go. You shoot 22 long rifle. Pull your little shell out. Load another one in. So, you got it. so this way, with the single shot shotgun... I've actually got a 12 gauge shotgun single shot, I got a 9mm single shot, and I got a 22 long rifle. That's something you can't beat with the versatility with a 12 gauge single shot shotgun. You can't beat that versatility. So when people talk about if there was going to be a bug out gun or a gun that I would take for me that I was going to have to carry, besides say if I had a sidearm like a 9mm pistol, but if not, this would be it. This would probably be it more than my 12 gauge pump because of the adapters. I could take this with my 12 gauge or if I find some 22s, I can pack that or if I find 9 millimeter water, but I got three different calibers in this one shotgun. And you're talking about sweet. You just can't beat that, guys. And then you can get other adapters. You can get 38 Special. You get 40 Smith & Wesson. I mean, the sky's the limit. You can even get a 20-gauge adapter to shoot 20-gauge through this if you want, or 410. So the sky's the limit on this 12-gauge single-shot shotgun. And so that's why Little Thumper here will always be in my possession. It's a prized gun I got now, and I love it. And uh, just thought I'd show it again in my single-shot shotgun rifle series. Okay, guys. Well, he'll be a you. God bless.